It made a difference in my life by me allowing myself to receive treatment without the worry of how I'm going to get there, how I'm going to eat, the funding, all this kind of stuff that really created an atmosphere of calmness that facilitates healing. Being so close to where my procedure was performed, which is next door, was unbelievably delightful. <laughs> I used to work with children a lot, and I was aware of the children's room. That's another factor that sometimes gets overlooked is how the kids are, are thought about. They're not excluded and say, this is part of the family environment. And uh, it's well done. I would like to say to the members, thank you. Thank you for the seeds that have grown and allowed the whole foundation to make something very significant so that each of the members can look and know they're part of it. A lot of students graduate from college with either enormous loan debt or, you know, a lot of my friends in college had to cut their education short because of how, how expensive college is. Receiving the People Helping People Scholarship allowed me to spend my college time um, doing internships and service learning projects. Rather than me working minimum wage jobs, I was um, able to work through Parkridge Health in an internship and through several local physical therapy offices. And as a result of those internships and service learning projects, I was offered a job in the healthcare field, which is exactly what I wanted my entire college career. A huge heartfelt thank you out to all of the State Employees Credit Union members and the State Employees Credit Union Foundation for helping me go to college and helping me achieve my dreams. I'm interning at the Southeastern Family Violence Center in Lumberton, North Carolina, which is an agency that's dedicated to assisting survivors of domestic violence. When I learned that I was one of the students chosen for the internship program, I was extremely excited. I immediately called on my family members to let them know. I was excited to know that my summer would be spent doing something productive. And I was also excited to use what I had learned in the classroom in real life settings. When I found out that this internship was paid, you know, that was one thing off my list. And so I was able to balance summer classes, my summer plans that I had already made, as well as this internship and job experience. It's, these internship programs are enrichment opportunities that are improving the overall value of our education. And I firmly believe that education is key and that if you improve any type of education at any level, it's going to impact the economy in a positive way. I'm excited to take what I've learned from this experience and to apply it to a future career. And I truly do thank all of you who made it possible.
since I've been here, um, number one, I feel a lot more confident. I had no confidence. I feel like I had reached a low point in my life. And since I've come here, it's amazing what having your own space can do for you. And especially when you have kids and you're not stressing about like where your next meal is gonna come from or where you're gonna lay your head at at nighttime. Um, so I'm able to focus a lot more. I was able to come here and graduate from the culinary arts class. I landed a job, which is very difficult when you have a felony. And I've also gotten a van. I had no transportation of my own. I had to ride the bus and that's a hassle in itself. So it's it's been an amazing transformation. I've got my own place now. I have a place to work. I actually have a clear cut goals for a future and my kids are happy and I just feel like I actually have a good step in the right direction. And a lot of times people don't notice the small changes, but I'm a small change and I've come a long way and it's all because of you guys, so thanks.